Hi guys, Dan Higgins here from Astroworld and thank you so much for returning for part five of our Eagle 3 tutorial, software installations. If you like what you see, please subscribe, please like us on Facebook. We love the comments, we love the feedback. So everybody, please uh, comment below. And if you have any questions, just feel free to ask. Uh, we love to hear from all of our, our viewers and our subscribers. So that being said, Without further ado, let's move to part five, software installations. The Eagle is built on the Windows operating system, so it's pretty much compatible with any piece of astronomy software out there, which is a wonderful thing. However, as you examine the Eagle, you may notice it doesn't have a CD player in it. But who needs it? You have an Eagle, so you don't need a CD player. Once you connect to the Eagle, you're going to see the Eagle interface. If you minimize that Eagle interface, you will see a Windows desktop. Now it does come with Internet Explorer, it does not come with Edge even though it's a Windows 10 computer, but you're more than welcome to download your browser of choice, whether that be Chrome or Firefox or whatever you decide to do. Once you have your browser of choice downloaded, feel free to download any piece of software you wish in order to load up your rig whether that be Sequence Generator Pro, Backyard Nikon, EOS, Astro Tortilla, whatever you want, as long as you don't forget the ASCOM platform and the required ASCOM drivers for your rig. So that's pretty much all there is to software installations. It's actually our shortest video in this project. There's really nothing to it except a lot of loading time. And coming up next is part six of our Eagle 3 tutorial. Hardware and peripheral installations. And remember to comment, remember to subscribe, remember to like us on Facebook. We appreciate all the support. But for now, this is Dan Higgins from Astroworld. And remember, keep imaging, keep educating, keep having fun. My name is Dan Higgins for Astroworld. Thank you for watching.